Within the past few years, Miami-Dade County has started a debate about the role of libraries in the new digital society. Miami-Dade Mayor Carlos Jimenez has proposed closing libraries every year, targeting employees and branches infrequently used or close to others. But according to community activist Nathaniel Sandler, the library system is much more than just a building full of books. Putting libraries through the prism of only books is incredibly short-sighted because really there's a million other things that they're doing. They're serving young people like kids, old people, and they're serving the, the internetless uh, and all of these things that if you were to take away then there would literally be no public space left in, in America. Still, Sandler decided to do something he could afford. Bookleggers is a nonprofit independent mobile library and we do monthly events where we give away free books to whoever's in attendance so everyone that comes gets one free book and afterwards books are available for trade or for a small fee. It's amazing because it kind of brings the community to you by taking you out into the community. I think it's like a jack of all trades like sometimes you'll find that book where it's like yeah, I, I can see why they put that, but then sometimes you find like Joyce Carol Oates or like even Dean Coop, so it's like a, it's just like a, you just gotta pick and choose, but it's a nice variety, I like it. And it's pretty cool to see a new way for people to come and check books out. One of these events included bookleggers teaming up with Oh Miami during a dog adoption. For Oh Miami last year we did dog leggers um, where there were a bunch of dogs, but also a dog adoption agency group, and then Oh Miami had people writing poems to their dogs, and we had a table full of dog books, and then we had all these toys and cookies for the dogs and stuff like that. Um, and we also set up um, semi-permanent libraries throughout the city, whether it's in an organization or in a business or on the street level, where books are typically available um, for free all day, every day. Bookleggers has extended the boundaries of the public library system, but Nathaniel doesn't see his organization as the solution. The, the long-term plays that I have don't include <laughs> bookleggers becoming, you know, a public service in that way because it would be, you know, I don't want the library system to go away. You know what I mean? Like, I think that, I think that Getting rid of an institution that Benjamin Franklin started is not what I'm here to do. It's just, it's, it's not. I mean, I'm here to be an alternative. I'm here to be fun. I'm here to help those people when I can, but also help people that maybe the library system can't help at the same time.